Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it is now week 34 of my weight loss journey. Let's go ahead and see how much I weigh. Okay, so before I get into talking about my weight, which y'all just saw, please excuse the hat. I know you guys are probably like, why are you wearing a hat when you're indoors? I just got back from the dog park and so I have major hat hair. So I'm just gonna go ahead and leave it on. I hope you don't mind. Um, so in the last weigh-in video, I weighed in at, let me see, I weighed in at 230.6. As y'all just saw, I weighed in at 228.8, which brings me to a total of 1.8 pounds down in the last two weeks. Not my proudest moments. I, truthfully, I just have not been eating the greatest. Um, I obviously have, not, I guess it's not obvious, I've still lost some weight, but not as much as I had been. But I don't think I think it's mostly because I have not been eating the greatest. I have not been really caring too much about being in a super calorie deficit, which is not great, y'all. I'm really not, I'm not proud of myself. But as of September, I have my September goals. Janae had shared this little um, thing on her fitness Instagram of like three things that you want um, for September, and one of mine was to dedicate this entire month to eating on track with only two treat days or whatever you want to call them, like only having like two treats but I'm gonna tell you a secret about that in a minute. And um, I wanna work out, I've been taking Rocky for walks at six in the, I can't even talk. I talk too fast, I'm sorry. I have been taking Rocky for walks at six in the morning every morning, trying to get at least eight to 10,000 steps a day, which has been working great. Some mornings are harder than others. Um, hold on one second, let me let Rocky in the room. Okay, so I said, yeah, I've been taking Rocky for walks in the morning and then I wanna continue to do that. I want to eat mostly on track all week, or not all week, all month, and, um, oh my goodness, what was my last one? I'll be right back. I'm going to go ahead and look up what it was, because I can't remember. <laughs> so other than taking Rocky for walks, my third um, September goal is to focus on strength training instead of cardio. I do have an elliptical here at home, which I was using a lot. I know when you're losing weight, you want to do a mixture of strength training and cardio. Well, for a little bit, I was doing some strength training because I do have weights also, and then I would do cardio. Well, then it got to a point where it was like, if I do just cardio, I lose the weight faster, but I'm also gonna have a lot more loose skin, blah, 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 blah. Well, I've decided to buy Mari Fitness. She's a influencer on YouTube and on Instagram. She's um, lost, I believe, like 70 or 75 pounds, and she made gym guides and at-home guides, and so I recently bought her at-home guides, and y'all, I barely did day two yesterday, which is like mostly, um, it's like legs, arms, um, like a rest day, legs, or arms, legs, or whatever. Did I even say that right? It's arms, legs, rest, um, arms, legs, whatever. Y'all know what I mean. Well, let me tell y'all right now, that thing kicks your freaking butt. And you would think, okay, well, it's not a, a gym. Like, you're doing it at home. It was just as hard. Jacob was sitting on the couch watching me do legs yesterday. My legs are extremely sore. And as he's sitting on the couch, he's like, wow, you're sweating a lot. Yeah, it was taking a lot out of me and it burned some serious calories. So um, I am looking forward. I will probably end up losing weight a lot slower. But if that means I'm going to build muscle and have more um, like curves and have my body toned to like the way I want it, I would much rather prefer that. And I'm going to continue to stick to that, especially because in the last two days of just using it, I feel like I've already got my money's worth. Um, I'm really sore. Like I was really sore on my arms, like my triceps, and today is my legs because the legs were yesterday. So yes, that is so worth the money. I will go ahead and link her Instagram in the description bar and y'all need to go check her out. She's amazing and she has, she lost all her weight strength training, not even really doing cardio. So like 10 out of 10 would recommend. And then I said I would tell you guys about my little treat days. Well, yesterday I discovered one of the girls that follows Mari's guides um, has her own Instagram and she made like, she finds like healthier desserts and she made a um, Greek yogurt cheesecake. Well, yesterday I was like craving sweets and this is already, yesterday was like day two of me craving sweets and I was like, no, I don't need it. I've been having a lot of trouble with like my mentality about this. It, I'll just be like, you know, I really, really want it it's fine, I'll wait a day to see if I still want it. The next day I'm like, I really, really want it. But then I think about it. I went to the grocery store with Jacob and I'm like, Justine, yeah, those cookies look good. Yeah, those, that freaking Kit Kat bar and Reese's looks good. 
but is it worth the way that you're going to be feeling after you eat it? And it wasn't. So I didn't get it. I walked away and I was kind of heartbroken, which is kind of depressing because I came home and I cried and I wasn't crying because I didn't get a freaking cookie or candy bar. I cried because I felt like, like I'm letting those things control my life. I'm letting, letting the, it's good that I can walk away, but it also sucks because it's like, I don't know y'all. I don't, I honestly don't, can't explain it. I just feel defeated and it was really, just really frustrating. I had a moment. The moment has passed. So yesterday I made her little Funfetti cheesecake that she made um, with a little graham cracker crust. And y'all let me tell you, I will be doing a freaking video on that. It was so good. Like it's one thing like when you bake cheesecakes, when you eat it warm, it's like the, it's kind of weird because the top will be like a little hard and the inside will be like really fluffy, almost kind of like an omelet, which is kind of weird and like off putting, but you're really supposed to be leaving it in the fridge overnight, but since I wanted some yesterday, I ate it. Well, this morning I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try a little sliver of it to see what it tastes like cold. Y'all, it tastes freaking amazing. Probably one of the best healthier desserts I've ever eaten, like so good. So I will be posting a video of that and I will be giving credit to the people who created the recipe because wow, 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 wow. It is so good, so good. Um, and I hope you guys are looking forward to that because I'm pretty sure anyone that's following me is either just a really supportive friend or family member, but also trying to lose weight themselves. So if you have a sweet tooth like me, which my sweet tooth never goes away, I got something for you in the next few videos. Um, so yeah, so those are my three goals for September. I'm just really going to focus on strength training, taking Rocky on walks. Um, that'll be like considered my cardio. I'm, and even on my rest days, I'm still going to be active and go on walks maybe go hiking with Jacob, maybe go, we have a lake by our house, maybe go rent a bike and ride around that. Um, yeah, I haven't really doing, been doing too much. I did re-download my fitness pal. I'm not calorie counting just because it, it got to a point where it was unhealthy. I was like, like worried about chewing a piece of gum because of the five calories that it had. So like, I'm not doing it, but I am loosely tracking. And by loosely, I mean like putting in what I'm eating just to get a, a guesstimate of what I'm eating around, like how many calories I'm eating, just to make sure that I am, I do continue to be in a deficit so that I can continue to lose weight because that is the name of the game. And that is the whole point that I've made this channel. So, um, yeah, haven't really been doing anything other than those two things, or I guess multiple things. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I'm all over the place. And I keep looking at these curls cause they look really funny. I'm easily distracted. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, other than that, nothing's really going on with my life just trying to continue to lose some weight i'm happy of the weight that i was able to get to but it could have been a lot lower but that's fine as long as it's down, going in the right direction i'm happy i have yet knock on like wood i have yet to hit a plateau with my weight which i really hope that doesn't happen until i'm already like in the hundreds um i do have some exciting news to share you um pretty soon jacob and i will be getting our orders hopefully within the next week and I believe I can tell you guys like at least the state that we'll be going into I'm not going to tell you guys a lot of information but I will be telling you guys when I find out um, after I tell my family and stuff and then I will be doing moving vlogs so I hope you guys are looking forward to that because I know I am um, honestly I do not do well under stress so I'm oh, I'm kind of dreading it also I don't like being surprised and so I don't like not knowing even a little bit of where we could possibly be going. That's kind of frustrating, but it's still an exciting life I live and good content for you guys. So yes, uh, I think that's all I have to say in this video. I know I kind of ramble, that is just my style. Um, and I guess if you haven't subscribed to go ahead and subscribe to me, I'd appreciate it. Um, if you could like this video, that'd be great too. Go ahead and leave a comment. Janae said, leave a comment of what your goals are for September, either health related or not health related. That was pretty good. And I don't want to steal that from my sister. So mine will be, go ahead and leave a comment of something exciting that's happening in your life right now. I want to be happy for you guys. So just, I don't know, you don't have to, but if you could, that'd be nice. Uh, yeah, so I guess I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye guys.